hello welcome to texture math in this session we will verify what will happen like if we try to perform some delete operation through complex view will it delete it the data or it will not delete the data so these all things uh, we will discuss in this session okay so for that first of all i will show you few queries that i have already executed to create the complex view and then we will discuss the delete operation so you here you can see that my first table name is emp uh, which contain three column employee id employee name department id another table is dept which is department table and there we have created two columns uh, department id and department name now using these two base table we are creating one complex view because we know that complex view means when we are using more than two tables as a base table okay so here i am creating the complex view named as emp depth so create view emp depth as and here we are selecting few columns from the employee table because e is the alias of employee table so employee id employee name and department id is coming from employee table and department name is coming from the department table because d is the alias of department table and then simply we are performing join operation to fetch the record on a specific condition all right so let me show you the exact data what we have stored already in this table so you can see in emp table we have this much of data and if i do the query on dpt table means department tables and then this is the department table data and i will show you the actual emp uh, means i will show you the query through emp dept view so this is the complex view result now what we will do firstly we will try to delete the data which is satisfying this view condition it means the four employee id is present in this view condition right we and we know that it does not store anything actually right it is just a replica of the original data it is not storing anything so we are just trying to uh, perform the delete operation through view we'll we'll check like whether it is allowed or not okay so here in employee id i will try to remove this employee id is 4 so let me retrieve this query that i have using delete from sharmit1 slash emp dept where employee id is 7 so what i'm trying to do i'm deleting this record from emp dept through emp dept so you can see we are getting this message view index or table emp depth in sharmit1 is read only so if i take f1 here you can see it is not allowing us because it is in read mo only mode and there are multiple reasons that could cause this issue uh, and you can see that one of the major issue that we are facing right now is the view or logical file references more than one tuple. So as we are using complex view, so it is not allowing us to perform delete operation and many other option, uh, reasons are also listed down here. But in our case, we are facing just because of this condition. So now it is clear that from through uh, complex view or EMP depth view, we are not supposed to delete anything all right now check one more thing what will happen if i try this is the record which is not present in i guess it is not present let me check again yeah so we tried to read that record which is not fulfilling sorry uh, it was mistake N previously what we tested we tested the record we, we tried to delete that record which is not present in the view condition now we will try to delete four because it is present and still it will give the same issue okay here you can see because it is not allowing whether uh, it is uh, present in base table or not it will not allow okay so let me uh, show you the same thing through sql rpg if you try to execute this program deletion in complex view where i'm storing the sql state as five times zeros then i'm setting the commitment control as star none and then we are uh, trying to delete the data from emp depth where employee id is seven or you can make it as make it as one also right and then we are checking for sql state if sql state underscore valid record deleted else we will print the sql state with a message query ended with an error and dev and i and i request a star okay so this is the way through which we can normally like we go and perform delete but if you try to compile this program it will fail although there is no mistake but still it is failing why let's check in spool file 
so if you press shift f6 here to reach the last spool file let me press it yeah so here you can see it is showing position 25 view index or table emp date in Sharmit one read only so same issue we are getting here also it will not allow us to compile because we are trying to perform the delete operation but from a read only file so which is not possible right so now I hope it is clear because in previous session we discussed about the simple view and there we were allowed to perform delete operation right whenever we are trying to delete anything it, it is actually deleting from the base table because view does not contain any data right so but in case of uh, this uh, complex view we are not supposed to perform delete operation and uh, we saw other condition also right uh, if you check if you press F1 on this error message it will show all those conditions so if any of this condition is uh, true it will not allow us to perform these operation okay so yeah and uh, same thing we also saw when we were discussing about the insertion process so in case of insertion also like we are not allowed to insert any data through a complex view so yeah that's all for this session I, I hope it is clear to all of you in the next session we will discuss few more things so thank you for watching TechSharmit